Hi guys, welcome and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, go ahead and hit that subscribe. So today we have another, well, pretty big AliExpress haul. We also have a couple things in from Sheen, Amazon, and I think that's about it. But we do have, or I do have some treats for a few friends in here as well. So guys, this is the time to grab your cup of tea because this is probably going to be another long haul. So if you want to grab and have your little merch and be a part of the fam, go to brianbrothers.com and get your mug or your sweaters. So yeah, guys, I love it. Cheers. Guys, so I thought we would start with just the Amazon stuff. It's like one thing. So I just wanted to show a uh, thing of pots. Just grabbed a big thing of pots. Nothing too crazy, but just in case you know or need to grab some uh, 10 gram pots. So these are the 10 gram pots that I get. And that's a 5 gram, just so you can see the difference. I like them. The lid's a smidge discolored in them, but I don't really care about that. It's hard to find them all really, really clear. I found a little bit different, but that's usually where I get them on Amazon. So if anybody needs to know that. Okay, so Sheen, I did go and I had to get some office stuff, but I grabbed like three or four nail things. <laughs> so this is what I grabbed from Sheen, or Sheen, sorry. Let's just start saying things correctly, Sheen. Okay, so I grabbed these little stickers because I just thought they were cute. Now they are just like checkers. Nothing too crazy, right? But it's just nice to have. So I grabbed two packs of those. I enjoyed. And I grabbed these for to do um, the swatch board. Oh my god, I really want to do it because I know it's like perfect Easter colors and fun. So I'm really hoping I can get to that really soon. Um, but I got these swatches for that. I thought those were so fancy. That would be really pretty for the swatch board that I want to try to create. And then I needed some <laughs> cuticle uh, wood sticks. They're a little short. They're very short. I think the standard is probably like down to here at least. So they're, they're tiny guys. And then this was on sale. I kind of forget what it was now. So these were solid builder gels. Oh, non-stick to hand. I think they're like the clay forming uh, 3D mold gels. That's what I want to say. All right, guys. So I did get one off, finally, not that red one. Oh my God, I'm gonna have to put some force into that guy. But I got the purple one off. It looks like it's almost like a, a jelly-ish. So they are, let's just use this. Okay, yeah, they're like the 3D molds. But that's pretty cool. I like that. So if they're all more like that jelly, I think you can make some pretty neat little things. Make like, I'm just thinking octopus. I, in the group we find like somebody just did an octopus set. Uh, some of the people in there are just so freaking creative. I don't know now. I just have purple. And purple's been such a popular color too in the group. So I think purple octopus. I don't know why I'm just wanting like and seeing this in my life. <laughs> I don't know. It's so inspiring. So I'm so glad to have these little dudes. Again, those were off Sheen. I will try to put the links for them. Um, I think that's it for Sheen. So let's just move to AliExpress. So I'm going to show these quick because they're just in my way. They're little dust collector, I don't know, covers. I've been using it and it actually works really well. I put a brand new filter in my dust collector and then I've just been putting this over top of it and it just sucks through nicely, but it saves my dust collector filter, right? So then I just doop doop and throw that in the garbage. You get a whole whack of them, uh, AliExpress. I'll put the link down there for you guys. Okay, these little guys. So these were just some letters that had little bling in them, nothing too, too crazed. I think when I was just going through my cards, I kind of say, okay, you haven't got that, you know, but either buy it or get rid of it. So this was one of the things, and I think it was about time that I needed to, but I remember when I was doing my charms, I think I needed some. So I think I was low in the letter department on the gold, but I'm not sure if that's the same. <laughs> I got two more things here. So here is like, they're little pebbles. I'm not going to take it out of this thing because they're hard to get back in. They're just like little, more like stones rather than seashells. I feel like these are more pebbly stones. Uh, but the colors are so appropriate for Easter. I thought maybe we could just try to do something with the little, just a cluster of them. I think clusters are just so cute. But that to me was such Easter vibes. Oh, I think I feel like I should have grabbed two of them. We need to go back and look at them. They're pretty. And I feel like I needed something here. Hold on. Let me just organize a little put away. I need a bin to put the stuff in. One sec, guys. 
Okay, I forgot that I had that box. Uh, I'm just keeping it for hauls like this because I think it's just easier, especially when I'm going to put it away. And at least it's all in one place for now because it can't sit on my desk like that. And there's no way I'm going to be able to put it away right today after this haul. We have to pick giveaway winners for over in the Facebook group. We have two giveaways, so we have to go pick them today. So I don't got time to do this. But at least it'll be all contained in a box. Don't get me wrong, I think you could get something much cuter than an old box. But there ain't nothing wrong with an old box either. Um, until I remember when I'm at Dollar Tree to find a cuter little something. Right? So, box it is. Okay, so we have our crystal little organizer guy. Or tray, sorry, not organizer. But organizer on my brain now. This was a mixed pack. I think it was probably a little pricey. Usually when I buy these, they're usually like eight or nine bucks or like six bucks. They're not usually ever cheaper than that, but they're like usually they their market is as like strass or something. And I'm I'm a sucker for when you 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 just give me in like that. So who knows? It could have been something of that sort. But that's just cute. I love little these little things. Little surprises for myself. But look at that one. Mm, that is gorgeous. Right? So pretty. Okay. Let's grab a pot. Always good to have a few pots on the side when you're doing hauls, just in case. Over the years, I'm learning or trying to remember all the tricks to make my life easier. There we go. Look at that. And just a little pot of goodness. Again, I have a mixed thing that when I'm organizing going back through this, I might throw it in there because something like that is very inspiring. For now, this is perfectly fine to transition to that place. And then I can boop it in the box and it's still organized and not have to grab everything for now, right? So pre-plan. Okay. We have some stickers. I'm so excited for this haul. There's more treats for my friends in here. I love it. I'm so happy because it's been sitting and I'm just like, oh my God, girl, you have to get a haul. Like it's been sitting here for a couple weeks. All well, no, we've had everything. Yeah, everything now for a couple weeks. Like all their treats um, have come in for at least a couple weeks. And I'm like, I need to get it filled. I want to get some of their treats though because I think there's, yeah, four people in here that I got treats for. So we're gonna have to mail them out separately, not all like not all the ones. Okay, some stickers. These are just white, but it's kind of look cool. I think that's a heart, like, yeah. So this is kind of see-through, so you would see the color of the heart on the inside. That's how like that's advertised. It's kind of cute. It's like a bubble, white it out, but you'll see the heart if you paint your nail underneath. Vibe. So those were cute. I grabbed two of those. Fruit. I think I get fruit every time, and I feel like I see these fruit every time. <laughs> Why do I love you? citrus i do personally love you you're very refreshing oh just good for spring a cute i think mom would love them on her nails try to do frenchies and do a couple of tulips very cute oh okay again just something different a little bit more colorful okay look at that look at the little like beach and everything that is so cool these are raised so i will say that well, that's just cuteness. A little bit more on the kittier side, but honestly, something like that. And just when you want to be more subtle and just a little something, why not? I think they're cute. More fruit. <laughs> like I said, I don't know why I keep buying those specific ones. Some clouds. Again, a little bit more funner clouds. Oh my god, that's in the shape of a bunny. That's just cute. Right? <laughs> there's some rainbows i could have used you guys on my saint patrick's day took me forever to get a rainbow down oh get my my sweet spot back so there we go those ones are gorgeous two right oh two of those oh some music colorful they are a little raised really pretty oh you're just stabbing me okay very pretty as well just some stars i know you can draw them but if you can't draw it, stick it, right? Ain't nothing wrong with it for now. We'll get there one day. One day, a little hard, little drop will just be easy for us. But sometimes that drop, 20 minutes to draw a drop. Doesn't even make sense. You're supposed to just drop it and go. <laughs> Why does it take me forever? And then the little paw prints. Again, probably easy to draw. But like, I don't know. They're just cute to me and I wanted them in sticker form. 
grab two of those adorable and then I can't I think these things are just so cute I don't know what it is about them I think that's some shorties they would just look adorable like I'm gonna make my mom press on so I think I'm just gonna put these little things on it and just just make her wear it right because I think it's cute <laughs> I think she would love it though oddly enough I think she would look at it every day and it would be fun that's what I think about it and she'd get giggles out of it and be like oh my god this girl what does she make for me that's what I wanted for her for something like as fun like these because I think they would be and they're just cute very cute oh I didn't know did I actually I was gonna say I swear I bought them if they were gifts so we got a good amount of stickers <clears throat> pardon me oh sorry guys I'll open my business Okay, here we have some polishes I know I went polish crazy so I have itchy I want to show you guys something <laughs> next because I want to use them after these polishes itchy face I'm just gonna take out these so these polishes I'm not gonna try to pronounce the name because I don't think I'm going to be able to but they reminded me the bottles reminded me of my Gary polishes and I actually store my Gary polishes on the side so you can only see this part of it so it looks exactly like my Gary polishes I'll show you here in a shake right but these ones when I seen them I was like oh you are a little different they are glitters so let me show you today we have we pulled out this color we're going to use for some top coats. I want to show you some top coats. So this is one of the Gary's 053, right? I don't know. I don't know how to pronounce that, so I'm not going to try, but it seems very, very similar to me. Right? So, anyways, can't reach it. I'm going to show you these colors that we went through. All of them had glitter in them. So I'm like, hey, why not? And I think there was only three or four different little collections. So I'm like, let me just slowly grab them and see if they're nice. We'll have to do, we'll swatch them because I actually have all of them. We'll do a swatch. Trust me guys, I'm going to get better at my swatches. I'm going to learn to love swatching. Watch. By the end of this, I'll love swatching. Ooh. I don't know if you guys are getting any justice. This is a beautiful green with some nice light glitter in it. This looks like a black. Ooh, with a gold glitter. Okay. I feel like the brushes look a little different to the Gary's. Maybe not. Probably the same. But that's like a beautiful blue. I'm so sorry guys if you're if that's not doing you justice. This doesn't look like it is, but oh that looks so pretty. We'll try to swatch and hopefully that day the camera will be nicer to us. This is like a purple with just it looks like a multicolor glitter. Like if you shift I can see pinks and different like colors. So I'm I'm assuming we're going like multicolor in there but like oh my god you look so pretty too oh my finger and this looks like a nice green oh it has like a gold are you getting anything i feel like we are oh but it's like a sagey green i don't know what do you call that sagey bossy i don't know but i like you we can be friends and then a beautiful oh <laughs> that was the gary purple that we were showing earlier not that that's a beautiful purple though I was like, oh, I like it. So we got that little set in. And I'm pretty sure we even have another set in here. But I think that was the first one. And I looked at it and I was like, oh, you look beautiful, right? So we will swatch them. They have a nice little consistency to them. But oh, and like I said, I can add it to my collection. My existing collection. And it's just going to look so perfect and uniform. And I was like, that's just so cool that that worked out that way. So I was like, hey, when I can add on to something, why not? Okay, I want to show these little guys. So these are little towelettes. 
And these are them too, but they don't say that they're tile lips. They're not mint. Um, so I kind of wish that they did say that they're tile lips because they kind of look like they could be mints. <laughs> so I grabbed two bags of them. Sorry. Okay, I grabbed two bags of them. I really like them, but I also wanted to grab two bags because I wanted the group to try them in the treat boxes. So I wanted to be able to put a couple in there. So I just get water. You can put in a little bowl, of course, but for this, I'm just gonna use that because it's close to me. And you just get a little bit of water. That's all you really do. And then it just turns into a little towel. But I'm telling you, it's the most convenient thing when you're in the studio because they're actually strong little towels. Even when you're trying to get off dust, like they are. I, don't, I freaking love them to get in there. Like, oh, I think they work really, really well. So I like them even for right now to wash, just to give my hands a thing. I know you're sitting here for five minutes with me cleaning my hands, but stuff's dirty too. The packaging, right? So even that just to have on your kind of handy, I love them. So I thought I would just put a couple in the tree boxes so everybody can get a little bit of a try. Also, um, I grabbed, oh, I forgot to bring them out though. Um, dental bibs. Uh, I got them from Crazy Bins. I've told you about that place. It's kind of like a Amazon return place. Well, we have it in our local area. So I went there and I got these for the, I think it was a $3 day and they had three things. I found three things, the dental bibs, so nine bucks. So I was like, hey, I can line the boxes with them and put these little things in it just for people to try different things, right? So that was my idea behind that. But they're actually in the shipping area anyway, so. You'll see them in another video. I got a couple more black boxes. This is from Ali. I don't know what's going on with them. When I was trying to get them for Canada, they weren't saying they were shipping to me. So that was freaking me out. This was like one of the quick ones. I don't know guys. So what's going on with them? Maybe I think I was hoping it was just something to do with the Chinese New Year, to be honest. So that's why I'm like, mm, but I love them. And I want to get a hold of them and see if they'll sell me refills. Like if they did, oh, I would love you guys forever. So I will put the link for them. Favorite. I just, the curvature of the actual nails, sometimes they come a little messed up in the box. I'm not going to lie. And they're not like labeled. So you have to go back on and then mark them down properly. This was a um, extra short coffin. But I think it was like a um, sculpted, like shaped. I, the only one they had or something. I was like, okay, let me try. I'm like little shorties. And we do different things in design and nail carts. So. It's always fun to have the shorter ones too, an extra short, right? And just to get practice on different length nails, I find it harder on short nails. You have less room. Okay, here, oh, these are just some short nail tips for swatching when I'm doing little demonstrations or anything like that. I like to have them handy, like something like this. When I want to show you guys, put a nail on it. I'd rather get these little guys than take them out of my boxes. So that was just a very short one. Again, practicing on short nails. I know not a lot of people like to look at that, but it's harder on your skills. So I want to just practice, right? Again, we have a one in some ovals for that. Love. Oh yeah, some fingers. I know, you're probably a girl. Don't you have enough fingers? <laughs> I do have a couple. Yeah, I got three of them. So I got three different fingers. And to be honest, the reason I got them is that they were on sale for $4. So I was like, that's so cheap. So I just got a couple for the group, actually, for the tree boxes. <clears throat> Maybe just somebody could use a finger to try. I thought they'd be pretty cool. So I just got a couple, not in two craze. We'll set them there. Actually, I actually don't want you in my box if you don't mind. See you over there. Oh, these tips. Okay. I know I keep saying I'm gonna buy different tips. These tips were whew, crazy though. Look at these. They're ovals, but they're hecka long. <laughs> Look at that. Like that would be. That's crazy, guys. I want to try it, though. <laughs> right? It's just the shape. Oh, I love that shape. Okay. 
So we have a box of those and I didn't have anything like that. So I was like, hey, let me just, let me throw them in the cart and bring them home. Oh, okay. So I grabbed another one of these in white. I know I'm crazy, but I wanted to see what it would be like. This, I might regret it because I might get dirty very fast, but again, it's only going to be for crystals. So I don't know the white or the black, which one will like, but I want to try and just see. Oh, okay, this kit. Oh, I have the whole kit. Take a couple out. So here, Vendini. Now, do I prefer the pink bottle over the green bottle? A little bit. Why? Because that whole collection right here is Vendini and it's all pink. Um, and that's not one collection, it's like three or four different collections in that rack, but I love how they're all the same bottles, so it just was nice. Now I have, but now I have this one and it's, it's worth it because of what is in the bottle. So I was like, I don't even care. And they're really nice bottles as it is. But these are just, oh my God, I'm absolutely loving them. So in our group, somebody, well, I know who it is, is Miss es Esmeralda. She showed a picture of a beautiful color. Um, I think I want to try to find it. Oh, I don't even know. There, it's actually, I don't know if I'll be able to find the box like that. So let's see this one. Oh no, that's not it either. Ooh. 13. Uh. So pretty. But I think it was 11 though, the number on here. So I'll show you in the color card because this does come with a color card. Ah! Isn't it beautiful? God. So she had this color on. It was just as a color. It was, I don't even think she did the effect of it. I'm pretty positive this is a cat eye uh, effect. See the cat eye vibe? But it's just like this pearled cat eye. So, so pretty. So she had this color on and I was like, oh my God, like, what is that color? What, like, what, where is it? Where did you get it? And she's like, oh, I think you have it. And I was like, uh-huh. She said, oh, it's Vendini oh, 11. And I was like, hmm, okay. So I went on a little hunt in that whole thing. And I was like, no, ma'am, I don't have that. Crystal has it now. Um, but I couldn't find the color by itself. I could only find it in the collection form. So, huh, I guess we got the whole collection. <laughs> A little treat. Oh my god, it is so pretty though. I love color cards too. Okay guys, so this is actually a Cody's top coat. Um, I think it's just like the PETA one. I accidentally bought in two. So I'm just going to set that over there because, well... I remember I told you guys, uh, <laughs> I was like looking for effect top coats and Lily Q, I got a couple from them and I was like, oh, they're cute. But yeah, the bottles are just tiny and that. Well, in my searches on Alley, I found a brand called Cody's and they seemed to be nice. I grabbed one and it was a little hearts and I was like, oh, that's nice. So I wanted to try a couple more. So just over time, probably the last month or so. Uh, I've been ordering them and they come fast. Like, I don't know why everybody thinks Allie just takes forever. I don't find Allie takes that long. Right? Well, if you order one thing, maybe like, meaning if you're waiting on one thing, but if you order here and there, then it's kind of like you're, you're always getting little treats and you'll forget that one thing took two weeks. So this is so pretty. The brush is nice on them too. So I believe these are all Hema free. I think, actually, I don't want to say that they are because they don't say that they are on it. I just know that Cody's was Hema Free. I don't know. So I lied. I don't want to say that because I'm not 100% sure. So I take it back. Um, but there is a few things from Cody's that is Hema Free because I did buy something that they said was Hema Free. Um, so I'm not, but I'm not sure if these are. So anyways, this is a luminous one. So this is just a glow in the dark. If you want your nails to become glow in the dark, you can add that as a top coat. So this is the diamond glitter. So when I say I bought a couple here and there, we ended up with 19 of them. Yeah, I know. And these are not the freaking cheapest, but they're so pretty. Look at them. Not bad. 
And here we go. A milky white top coat. Gorgeous. This is a Roy top coat number two. I think they have like 38 or something different. I don't, we're not, I, we're not getting all of them. That's crazy. <sighs> I might have two more coming. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Guys, I don't know. Like, look at that. We can just make anything that. Look at that. Okay. So there we go. That's number two. Let's just try it. I have a little nail, you know, let's go purple. I've been loving the purple. So I believe this was the Gary polish. Right, just a basic, not basic, don't get me wrong. That purple is gorgeous on itself, but you know what I'm saying. We're going to downgrade the purple for a second. Just basic old purple. And then now you have, and it's just this. Right? Why wouldn't you want to just shazam them up a wee? Okay, let's give that a quick cure. Glitter top coat to 305. We're not going to test all, but I have three nails, so I want to go through a couple of them. Ooh, so this is like the Aurora top coat. Oh my god. So that looks like you're going to get like a milky pinky purple. You would like, ooh, compliment my sweater so nice right now. That would. Sorry. Itchy nose. Uh, Christmas snowflake top coat. Okay. Oh my god, okay, so just some white glitter in there, some matte white glitter by the looks of that. Oh my god, that is so pretty. Okay, so let's check this one. Okay, the, sorry, put that over there. Time for truth. Ooh, not sticky, so good. Dries tack-free, right? but $13 a bottle. That's what it is on my end, right? Ouch. I know. Fudge sickles. Okay. Let's keep looking. What do we have here? Glitter Top Coat 303. And then we have here. Ooh, that's like a nice like gold finish. It's different. That brush is different as well. Mm, heart to glitter. I used this for Valentine's Day. I just wanted something so basic. And that's all I did. I just put little hearts. And that's what made me be like, huh? I like them. And they do. They have such a variety. That's the thing. The variety is crazy. I said, I think 36, 38 different ones. I don't know, something like that. Um, this one is the Pita Matte. Yeah, so that's the one that is in that little bag. But I'm not going to lie, one of mine came not with a thing on it. So I took it off that and put it on with mine. I'm not going to lie to you. Um, so that one will be give to, given away without the Cody's 2-in-1. But it still has the ingredients and that on it. But I'm sorry, that would have annoyed my life. And I bought two, so I was like, hey just the way it has to go so here we go here it's like the egg effect but it's very a much smaller like speckles so it's called I don't know guys that and that's a matte one as well so that's kind of cool that it's a matte one um, and this is a glitter top coat oh 307 That is so pretty too. That'll give you like that little bit of a blue hue. Should we try that one maybe? That one's pretty. Again, this is like a turquoise, so I'm just curious to see if it'll do anything to it. Be a little bit different. Ooh, it's kind of giving like emerald-ish vibes now. Let me see that though. 
that was really pretty that was 307 and this is a matte silver top coat oh that i think i remember the glitter oh yeah but it's matte love it so some of that okay so that brush is different that's a, the what i'm used to that one was a little the head was a bit different that is so pretty i love that okay what is this one? Opal purple. Ooh, that would probably look good at that purple that Madame Glam. Ooh. That is gorgeous. Okay, so. Opal fire. So this is opal purple. So I think this will look so, I wanna try this one over this. This is just Madame Glam office gossip beautiful beautiful color so i want to i did matte it with their velvet top coat so it's a little textured this will stick on it fine oh my god like look at that what's going on thank you and it just like melts into it it's not giving it bulk or anything okay gorgeous that's so pretty we have a couple more <laughs> so this is matte gold okay so again we have the gold flakes gold glitter it's so pretty but that's gonna dry matte 309 oh look at this one it's like an opaly green. Oh my god. Right? That would have looked good on that one too. Nice. That one needs to be wiped off though. This is a matte top coat. Okay, so that's just the regular matte top coat. I think I just want to give that a go as well. Uh, a two in one glitter top coat, K0029. Okay, so that is like a rose gold. Oh my god. I feel like we need to like use one. Let's see. So this is... Oh, now I forget. I should have left them out. Sorry guys. That's that one. That's so pretty. And then this is that one as well. Oh my god. Are they just... Yeah, there's no real oh, a little lump there, but that probably was me. That's so pretty. Let's try this one for a sec, just because I need to see this in my life. It's unconventional that you go on here. But I want it. Oh my god. Okay. Let's just see. I don't want to go too thick. But again, I'm going to want to play with the formula. I'm going to want to see if there's something where you do have to file it or anything like that but oh my god it's so pretty okay we have some more sticker decals these are some bugs <laughs> i don't know i just thought they're cute who knows there's some bug nails some dinosaurs oh my god they're just so cute little raccoon guys some arabidics why not? Like you could just do a whole yellow nail and then throw one of them on. Something so simple but so stinking cute. Oh my. Look at those little guys. Penguins. A little under the sea vibes. Oh. That was nice. We have little teddy bears. I don't know if I threw them in or bought them. I feel like I could have bought them. Oh, that would go nice with those. That top coat. Right? The bubblegum top coat. That look just like them. Oh my god, with the little bears. Guys, we could do so much stuff. I love looking through my swole. Getting new stuff I love, but I need to start going back organizing and going through my stuff to see what we have. So I grabbed some sushi. Again, just so cute. I didn't have much food stickers, so I wanted to go get some food stickers. Again, just some sushi. And then just some frames. Kind of neat. Some bugs. You never know when you're going to need. Ooh. No, like some birds now that's cute right i feel like i should have grabbed two of them 
did I? Nope. And then some frames again. I thought, who knows? You could do like a 3D vibe, put one of them down and then put a real frame. Kind of kitty quarter. I don't know. Do like house of frames on a nail. Who knows? Just thought they were cool to have. <laughs> Love them. So some cool stickers. Oh, I grabbed another tray. I think that wasn't broken. That still doesn't seem to be broken. That seemed good, so I was happy about that. Why are you not coming? What's happening? Okay, so here we go. It's just a tray. I actually got in um, BDD crystals that are different shapes. I thought I could just make a whole box for them. I thought that would be pretty cool. So I wanna see how much and if that could work. Until we organize, keep her in there. What is this? Looks like glue. Okay, so definitely my favorite glue, 601 Born Pretty. I get it off of Ali as well. Okay guys, so again, those polishes got me. They all have glitters. I think I did, I bought the last one last week they're only about 20 bucks it's not even bad nice good thick consistency nice little brush on them they really remind me of the gary like are you gary secretly but whatever the that is they all have a glitter so this has like a nice little gold glitter it's hard to see i feel like it's a different brush i don't know if all the brushes are consistent I feel like some are round and some are just straight. But they all do have a glitter. Okay, no, that one is too. Maybe it's just me playing tricks on me. Who knows? And then here. Oh my god. It's like a really like dark dark green, almost emerald-y vibe I feel. It's so pretty. Gold glitter in it. Oh, so any gold accents, but gold and greens look really, really pretty together. Ow. Very tight-fitting lids. Oh, again, I think a lot of them have that gold. It's so hard to see on camera. gold again love it so pretty so this is just adding to my gary collection and it's just glitters <laughs> good fall colors i think this would be really nice i love these two they're very similar but they're not the same kind of want to see the difference quickly okay caramel and i think we have oh yeah we're getting a little bit more you know that money color i always say Big difference, right? Pretty. Oh, we got some more tips, just practice tips. Oh, let's look at that. Yeah, it is a little bit, like you would probably need a slight file for something like that if you don't want it textured. They're all so pretty. Like the top coats are just crazy. I love that. <laughs> Again, you can add a lot to something with like little, no bulk, right? That's what I feel. Okay, so we're getting low now. We're getting there. But then I have, remember I have some treats for some friends. So I want to share that. Okay. We have some bows, just some basic bows, but to be honest, I've been seeing these everywhere in Korean nail art, so I'm like, oh, I need them. They're just cute. So I wanted them. We have some crowns, okay. Oh, 
This might be a little bit more difficult because, you know, what it is. This is a... What's going on here? Little crown, but that's going to stand up like crazy. I'll tell you that right now. But if you don't care... Right, that's standing up tall. But if you don't care... Oh my God. I love that though. I think it could still be really fun, actually. Put a big crystal right in the top of it. Super cool. So we see it on the black. We see it on the white. I think the white might be better. Really pretty. Okay, so, oh, I grabbed two of these little magnets. Seen them everywhere. They're supposed to be to grab micro beads, caviar beads. So, we... so here we go. These are pretty big. I did grab two. Let's see. Get ripped off. Wow, it's not even a magnet. Unless my balls ain't my balls ain't metal. Well, what are they? Stupid. That was a rip off. Okay, well, hmm. I guess some things, right? That's what it was supposed to be for. It's a little magnet. I've seen it everywhere. Now I gotta go get another one. One of the donations, I thought they were moose ears, uh, but I think, are they moose ears? No, they're wings. Sorry, they're angel wings. Why do I think they're clouds now? They're angel wings. I thought they were moose ears. <laughs> but I was like, oh my god, I needed to find them. So I found them on Alley. Yeah, they're angel wings. Isn't that cool? Okay, couple of little donuts. Ain't nothing wrong with that. Just some sweets. So cute. So here we have a mold. I think it's just roses. Yeah, it's just a rose mold. And then we have some bows and a lace. But so cute, right? With the pink. I love them. Oh, two stamping plates from the Dollar Tree. I'm wondering if I have that one though. Oh, these are so cool. So now you can see here, they're just little Kind of like candy wrapper packages, but the little heart and the little diamonds. I love it. But it's so pretty. So the backs are a little hollowed out there. Will any of you just kind of hold? Maybe. Oh. Okay, it's going to kind of hold a particular way. It will sit on the nail. Out a little bit. But I thought they were so pretty. And little presents, but hearts. That's what I'm taking about it. Or candy, sorry, maybe. Something. Beautiful. My lips are dry. I need my real chapstick. That's making my dry that's making my lips more dry. So here we have them in like an emerald green. Gorgeous. Oh, we have little seashells. Those are so cute. Just in silver. Actually, when I, again, when I'm organizing, looking through, I don't have any of them in silver. I have a lot of them in gold. But hey, silver might come up one day. It's good to have. Okay, guys, I took them all out. Look at that. Oh, my gosh. So I believe that these are like a Strass mix. 
Holy, those are gorgeous. Let me know what you think. Do you like the white tray? Or did you guys prefer the black tray? Let's see. Okay. And there we go. That's so pretty. Can you see them? It all depends. The white's actually pretty good. Addition. And the back of them, guys, is so curved. The curvature on the back is phenomenal on those charms, too. Like, they're going to sit on the nail beautifully. Okay, I'll make sure I have the link. The brush. Okay, so what is this? A nail brush square. Okay. I guess I just wanted to get a square one and try. It's nice though, it's metal. It's a nice length. I need, I don't know, I like a brush to at least come back and sit there. So, hmm. I'm usually more a round brush girl, but I think again, I was on the hunt for a good brush, but I've been really enjoying the Lissette's brush, to be honest. Oh, that one I think is just a good, that one's a good one, but we can try. Why not? Glad to have her. Put her in there. Okay, we have more stickers. Okay, so here we have some lips. Some more lips. Some more lips. <laughs> I don't know, some naughty lips. I guess I was on a lip phase. I don't know, guys. Get your tongue in your mouth, young lady. Kind of cool though, just to have again. It must have been pretty reasonable, but I don't think I'll need any more lips. Little Marilyn in our tie. Pretty. Okay, so we have them in blue as well. Again, like that blue. Hmm. That is just gorgeous, guys. Oh, okay, so we have a couple Wilson bits. These are legit my favorite bits. These are like the only bits I use on the Wilson company. I get them off AliExpress. They're not the cheapest, but they're not the most expensive either. A few dollars. I have a little diamond in there. This one is my go-to for pretty much everything um, because I just don't need any harder. So I just got a medium barrel, so I wanted to get two more of them, so I have. Okay, oh, and we got the same brush in a round. That sounds more like me, but I probably just wanted to see the square. Oh, it does feel, oh, feels nice. And it is a little bit longer. Remember, I was looking for the longer as the little set here. Let me see. Oh, the lid. Oh, what are you doing? You got bent. Mm. Mm, so the set is actually longer. We have to go get a couple more of her brushes. Oh, but I have to save up for her. Because <laughs> I want a few things. I want to get a few things. It makes sense. I'm in Canada, so the shipping and that makes sense to get a couple things when I'm over there. So that's cool to have the round one. So this is a little rhinestone picker. It's just a wax, but the wax goes at the bottom, so you can just like... Oh, it's going a little too tight, maybe. Yeah, so it'll just be like a little wax guide to grab your crystals. I think I put a little too much. The wax seems very soft, though, actually. It's supposed to be that soft. I don't know, but, so I wanted to see what it was all about. Um, maybe it needs to cool in the house a little, the pressure. Okay, yeah. Okay. Okay, so here comes some wax tamps. But I think I'm pretty sure I paid for them separately. And then these are some crystals, but I feel like... These will look better on a black. Oh wow. 
There we go. They're just little crystal pieces, but they have flowers and a couple of snowflake. I also got two packs of them. Isn't that so pretty though? It will stand up. But it's possible. Oh, that's so pretty. Let me just see. Yeah, he wouldn't be able to see that on the white. So I guess it all depends on what you're doing. It's good to have both. I'm fine with both of them going in the same thing, I think. Okay, so these are the studs. Again, just different colors. And they had them in literally a whole whack of different colors, but like a chromey vibe. Look at that, eh? So I got two packs, one of each. Good to have. Again, you never know when you just want to go a little crazy. Again, I'm building a collection, right? So to me, you never know what I'm going to want to do when it comes to creating content. So I look for everything. These are beautiful flowers. Like, look at these. They're not curved. But look at that flower with the greenery on it. That is really pretty. And then even here we have some greenery. Mm -hmm. Right? They're hard to draw the leaves. Really glad to have them. I should probably back have a backup. Oh, some like fox heads. Those are really pretty. Again, they're not curved, but that's a good size as well. That's not that big. You can put that on your head nicely. Or your hands nicely. Some lock-in key. Super cute. Oh, some very, very dainty hearts. Those are really cute to have too. Oh, we can do some really fun stuff with them. Oh, some blueberries. Oh, those are just the cutest things. So we got some blueberries with the greenery. Again, you got a decent amount too. Sorry guys, I don't remember the price. I'm in Canada too, so the prices are going to change. But I'll have all the links down there. Or as much links as I can. Some locking keys. A little bit more daintier with these locking keys. Sorry. And here we go with lock and key again. And one more lock and key in case I didn't have enough. But they are actually different style of lock and key if you look. And that's gold and silver actually. And then here those two are different gold and silver. So different sizes. Okay. So we have a couple more things. Not a lot guys. And then I'll show you the couple things for the ladies. So look at this little crystal. This crystal was like a dope, like honestly, maybe not a dollar, like two dollars though. It was not the cheapest thing, but I wanted to see what it was in the size. So I don't know if I'd ever like go crazy. It's expensive for one, but it's supposed to be a real stone or something. But I thought it was so freaking pretty. And then on that same store, I got these that are like real stones. What's on my nail? I thought those were so cool, no? I want to go back and just like really take a look but I wanted to check out the sizes because sometimes they trick me in there but this, those are perfect for nail art sorry for the glare got a better look at them there but right really pretty really dainty that one is put them up there so I don't lose them okay so a couple more things guys here we have the full beauty debonder that I personally like but I just wanted to get a different uh, debonder and just try it against it I really so yeah I just thought grabbing this one and I could see if it works exactly the same so if you can't get the full beauty you could always just know to go for the A1 debonder and the brand maybe doesn't matter so just to check her out test it well, there. we have two stamping plates this one is nature Ooh, like a tornado oh look at the cloud those are the clouds remember a while ago I said I ordered a cloud plate those are good clouds perfect cloud but yeah, look at that. That's like tornado vibes. That's so cool. Cad Nature 074. Hmm. Beautiful. And then here we have some Christmas elves, I believe. Little elves, little Christmas plate. Kind of cute though. A lot of different images. So I think we can get some good use out of that for sure. Oh, we want like little clocks. That's a good one. 
Okay. Oh, no, we're not done. Last, but certainly not least. Until we get to the treats. Okay, so here we have just some pretty colors. Like, really, when it comes to the browns and chocolate, they are raised. Look at that, though. That's so cool. Hmm. There's some sort of, like, resin, I'm assuming. They look like resin, guys. But I love the chocolate kind of vibe of them. I just think that's so cute. I don't know. I want to do some, like, chocolate cocoa nails. I don't know. Like, coffee and... I don't know. Maybe that's it. I want coffee nails with, like different stuff i don't know but i've just been loving the creams i love the creams i think that's what it is neutrals are like <laughs> my color palette so we have some cute little easter bunnies i hauled these recently these little guys it looks like this came in a little mixed pack that's super cute so maybe we'll just keep one i don't think i'll need two because i do have the other one as well and then we'll put that one in the giveaways we don't need two of those and then here we have some cute little bunnies those are so cute and they're fuzzy. Did we see this? Guys, they're actually fuzzy. Let's take it out. It looks fuzzy. That's so cute. <laughs> um, they're not curved at the back at all. So they're pretty straight. They're going to stick up on your nail. Pretty wide too, actually. Be cute. Yep. That's what we thought. But they're cute and we'll figure a way to stick her on there. So we have a couple more. Okay. And then we have the lighter ones. Oh, those are so cute too. And then more of the lighter ones. So they're all turned around. I think they're all the same though. They just have different things. So I got three lighter ones and two darker ones, I guess. So cute. Oh guys, I'm sorry. There was one more thing. I found this, I think it was like $7 or something. It was so reasonable. And I wanted to see what it was all about. And it looked so pretty. Like, look at those brushes. And I think it's just liners. Ooh, pretty. Okay. Light. Ooh, that's a baby liner. Look at that guy. Nice tight lid though. I like it. Do we have a long guy? Oh, there we go. Yeah, so I just thought they were really cute. Seven bucks. So I was like, let me try them. What's the worst, right? Okay, they do have a name on them. They're pretty though. Like I said, they're very light. But other than that. Nice six piece set. Cannot go wrong with that. Okay, so let's jump into this first. This set here. So I don't know if you guys remember, but I think in my last big haul, I said that I got a couple of my fam some treats. So those treats have also come in. There was a few more girls that I wanted to get a few more things for. So they've all finally came in now. So I want to give them out to these beautiful women and say thank you. But I want to show you what I got them first, right? So let's just go through and show you now these treats guys it's honestly just these women they go above and beyond they really have for me and my group and my community they're just huge big supporters and i just love them and i feel like i just want to show them that i appreciate them and that's why i do things that's why i would get somebody a treat it's nothing more than that it's because my heart told me to and you're sweet and i wanted to show you and let you know that you're sweet and i see you that I see you. Do you know what I mean? So that's it. That's all really. You know what I mean? So I just want to give you or I just want to show you guys what I got them so I can finally get it out to them. <laughs> so let's start with this one first. Okay, so I got this Mandini uh, collection. So I got this for Karina in the group. I call her Aunt Karina and I should really ask her actually if that is even okay. I've never asked her but to be honest the reason I even call her Aunt Karina is that I actually have an Aunt Karina. My mom's sister is a name Karina. So that's just what I reminds me of. To be honest, it's nothing more than that. And then like growing up, my Aunt Karina, she's just closer to all of our age. She's my mom's uh, youngest. Like she's a baby out of my grandparents' kids. So she grew up more of like my older sister, like around their age. So 
she was always just like there, like one of us. So honestly, I think that's really why I just call her Ankrita. I hope she's cool with it. I even call her husband Uncle Glitter Pants. But that's a long story. <laughs> I love that though. I love them. Like I just, uh, I just love our family so much. So I wanted to get her this. She literally, I feel like she is obsessed with cat eye. Um, so yeah, I just seen this cat eye and it's a little bit different from what I've seen that she's been showing. So I was like, oh, let me just throw this in at her. So I got her this little fluorescent cat eye set. And then I also have a set myself that's like over there. That's a fluorescent set that I think this could like a compliment to that set for me. So I actually went ahead and bought the same set <laughs> for myself. Oh, that's the thing about getting my girl, like my girlfriend's treats is once I see it, I'm like, hmm, I think I want that. I did that with freaking Annette. I got that whole collection. That whole collection's already up there. I have it. One of the cards there. It was the same day. The one I was showing, I kept that one and I sent her the new one. It came in. So crazy. But this is it. So, and then with this collection, again, I've had this for a little bit. So I've kind of already sent, uh, sent Aunt Karina hers. So this one I've just been using. So I'm going to show you guys now. Okay, so this is this little set. So here is the bottles. Now that looks like they got a little dirty from that packaging, but it's okay. So let's just go through quick and look at these. Oh my god. I don't know. I thought, to be honest, like I said, I just, when I seen them, I just thought of her. And like, that's truly how I get my friends, like, gifts. If it reminds me of them. She loves cat eye. And I don't know why. I was like, oh, the fluorescent one would be so cool. I bet she'd have fun with that. Right? And then I bought it for her. And like two days later, it went on sale. <laughs> So I was like, by golly, I think it'd be fun for me too. So I got one for myself. So to be honest, I've had, like I said, I've had it for a little bit. So I was able to ship hers to her already. <laughs> but again, I wanted to show you guys. They're so pretty. Such a cute little collection. Again, I enjoy the consistency of Vendini. It's, it's a good, like medium consistency and again I think I have what well, I think I have a fluorescent collection that I think this will complement so nice for the summertime but again this is cat eye so you can get your cat eye vibe from it oh my god that's so pretty but you can also wear it as just a regular color as well you're not you don't have to do the cat eye effect so it's almost like a double a double whammy. Your double purpose, really, right? My apologies. Oh my god. That one's freaking pretty too. Hmm. Gorgeous! So now I can put my little collection uh, away with the other on this shelf. <laughs> Isn't it so pretty though? I love it. I hope she loves hers too. I've seen her play with them, so I bet she does. I see things, you know. Ow. Put them there. So yeah, that's that technically I'm just gonna put there. That's why I opened it. These next couple guys, I'm not gonna actually op open them, open them, but I wanna show you what they are. So we have two different things here. Let me think, I think. So I think that one, so. I'm not actually don't remember, but I'll confirm because I just don't remember. So it might not be for each other. I'm not sure. Uh, but I grabbed a couple of these for some friends. So I actually grabbed one for Eileen, um, which I've been saying her name wrong this whole time. I thought it was Eileen for years, but it is what it is. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, anyways, so this uh, I wanted again I showed a couple people some pictures and some people played along and some people did not really play along with me uh, anyways in there there's this beautiful soul named Shelly in our group so I wanted to get her a little treat as well um, but I actually showed her in bingo one night I'm like hey would you like to pick um, just so if, again if she wanted to pick which one I think she picked this one in all truth I'll confirm it with her later so it might be this one but look at that right 
I think I do want to open, well, actually, I don't have to even open that part because you can see that pretty good. But look how gorgeous that is. Oh my god, right? I think that would just be so fun. I can't, I love these little kids. So I wanted to get her a little treat. Again, she's just amazing. She's just so helpful in the group. And I just love and I see and I recognize that. So thank you so much, love. Treats coming your way soon. Um, and then again, another beautiful soul. Like she's just done so much for us in the group. Marilyn, like I, oh, what can I say? Like she just... In the beginning, even like with her amazing donation, she's just done so much and she is, she's just so supportive. So I just wanted to give her a little treat and say thank you so much for just being, being a part of the fam and just, I love you, right? So I want to get her a little treat. So again, it'll be either this one or that one, but I think this one is going to be hers. Oh my God, I love that though. Look at those blue. That's like an icy blue, a goldy but greeny vibe. Mm, the darker blue, I love that. I love the two different vibes. And then the purple, but more maroon here. Love that one. The white, I love that one too. It's just a beautiful collection. Again, the Vindini collection. I love these polishes. I wanted to get her a treat. Again, you're just, you're amazing and I love you. So that's it guys, really. Uh, there is one more beautiful soul. Again, she's just an active woman. She is in there and you need help. She is probably one of the ones that will answer you back. She's just so sweet. And again, I, I do and I love and I appreciate her. So I wanted to get her a little something. Now with her, she actually has an allergy. So I needed to think about what I got her prior. So Miss Tiffany, and she does actually have a YouTube channel. I just want to make sure I say it right. Yeah. Unbound Nails by Tiff. Tiffany, sorry. I'll make sure I pop it up. So go check her YouTube channel out. But I wanted to get her a little something. But yeah, she's allergic to Hema. So that had to make me think about what I wanted to get her, right? So I actually went and got her this canny. Now this is Hema Free. So they actually have a Hema Free line. And I love um, Venelisa. And Venelisa is basically Canny's like sister brand. So Canny is the more like the mama. Yeah, so this is a Hema Free. So it does say here, and then obviously your subs. But I just thought for coming up in the Easter, that'd be such a cute collection for her. And then again on the Cody's, I see them they had a Hema Free primer, and I just have a feeling that primer is probably hard to find to get Hema Free. Um, so I wanted to get that too for her and put that in there. So I got that for Tiff. Um, yeah, so just because she's amazing. Again, she's just very active, and she's just very helpful, and I appreciate that. It really is what makes the group work. Like, it's one person can't do all that, guys, right? So I just love it and I appreciate all you guys. Guys, that is all my treats done. Thank you guys so much. Make sure you hit that subscribe, share it with a friend, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys.